6,716 entries were made in the 2017 World Series of Poker Monster Stack $1,500 No Limit Hold'em event, and early on day three there are only 120 players remaining. Among the notables still in the field are two-time bracelet winner Paul Volpe, Scott Baumstein, Scott Montgomery, Hall of Famer TJ Cloutier, 2015 WSOP Main Event Champion Joe McKeon, and Maurice Hawkins who was among the chip leaders on the second break of the day. Car Player TV caught up with Hawkins to ask him about how it feels to be deep in such a huge event. What's going on is I haven't flopped quads yet, so I'm looking forward to it. Um, and I think that should be my next hand. But we got 120 people between me and a million dollars in cash, so that's what I look like. I feel good about that. Hawkins set the record this year for the most WSOP circuit rings won when he took down his 10th title on the circuit. He has won four WSOPC main events and has proven to be one of the top players in the world in large field no limit hold'em tournaments. Um, I think I got a system down how to be bad players. I think I figured out how to be good players. Oh yeah, I figured out how to beat every kind of player, my bad. Yeah, so uh, it's going good. I just I approach it like it's just a big circuit because I'm good at those. And um, I look forward to just stacking faces and crushing souls. The eventual champion in this event is sent to win nearly $1.1 million, with the top eight finishers all scoring six-figure paydays. So make sure to stay tuned to carplayer.com to find out who emerges victorious in the monster stack at the 2017 World Series of Poker.